Bethany. Welcome to today's video. So today I'm pretty pumped to be finally working in my eight and a half by 11 plum paper hourly planner. And I'll admit it looks a little bit overwhelming right now. It is so much bigger than my other planner, but I think this is going to be really fun. I'm not doing a kit today. I'm just going to do some washi and I've got some functional stickers. So I'm just going to keep it pretty simple here while I'm getting used to where I want to put everything. And yeah, we're going to see how things go. Um, I didn't do a whole ton of personalization. I personalized a little bit when it comes to setting up this planner. So I did get this week printed here with plum paper. I also had it do the hour starting at seven o'clock, moving down to nine o'clock PM. What's nice about the eight and a half by 11 is you do get 14 hours. Whereas in the seven by nine, I think you only get 12. So it would go like seven to seven. So I do get a couple extra hours because of the bigger planner. I also get an extra line down here. So in the smaller planner. I think there's only the three bullets at the bottom, whereas we get four in the larger planner. So there are some kind of neat features there. I got habits printed here because what I'm thinking is I like to put a lot of little habit trackers over there. I think that's going to be cool. Um, I think the habit trackers that I have might be a little short, like they might not come out all the way and that's okay. I'm just going to kind of work with it and it's going to be fine. I haven't decided if I want to put dinners along the sidebar yet because that's something that I was um, doing once in my other planner that I kind of liked and I'm not sure what's going to go along the bottom yet so I'm just going to figure it out as I go. Um, there are some routine things I do at work so I was thinking maybe I'd put those kind of those checklist things down here maybe I will try that and then of course appointments and stuff throughout the day. So that's the game plan let's go ahead and get started with the washi. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not loving this one so far. Um, just a couple things. I probably should have whited out because you can see underneath here and then also down here you can see through it. I'm not liking that. Also this washi's too wide and it's kind of eating into the dates here. I don't like that either. I think I would prefer maybe some nice date covers or something and to just kind of make this look a little bit better. Just not wild about it. It's fine. It's cute. I'm just gonna use this planner. Um, the other thing is the supplements. I thought that they would not come all the way out just because this is a bigger area. So I might need to experiment with, I don't know, either seeing if I can find some stickers that um, I can print off or try to make some or something that fits a little better because I like the concept and I like how this is generally happening. I just don't like that it doesn't come all the way across. I wish it were a little bit, a little bit bigger and it fitted a little bit more. I also don't really need the fifth. Usually I kind of do these Four, like three or four habits and so I could easily kind of like blow all of this up a little bit and make it work for again five is nice but even like three or four would be fine so I'm gonna work on that I don't know that I have a sticker big enough to cover this so that's probably gonna stay for this time so yeah just being real with you I'm not loving this one it's okay it's fine it's just not not my favorite I also do miss having a kit I thought I would like just kind of doing washing stickers but I'm like Meh. I kind of I miss having kits so that's my one little note so far so I'm going to need to find sticker shop that has stickers that fit this really well or get used to printing my own or something like that there is a shop um, ever-changing plans I know I use them for other stickers as well and um, they do make stickers for this size planner and also there are some printables for it so I'm not at a total loss I'm just definitely spoiled with having really um, nice quality kits for the slightly smaller planner size and I'll need to figure this out so next I'm gonna do is go in and 
what should I do next? I'm going to probably just put appointments next so that I can see those and see where they fall in the hours and then um, work my way through from there. The additional color is making me a little bit happier and I am really liking the functionality of this planner so far. Like I definitely have more space to write. I could have even, you know, been writing even larger if I wanted to. So that's kind of nice. Um, the other thing too, is I do really like the having the hours, like having the hours actually on the page to help space things out and not trying to wonder, is this kind of where it is? Is it lining up with the other days? Does it make sense? Like. I was still trying to do that in the vertical columns and I like that the hours are just there and I can just use them. Um, the reason again I didn't want to do the hourly in the 7x9 is I just I do need that extra time in the evening for days when I do want it. So I think next what I want to do is put in dinner. So I'm trying to just work through what I know I, I want in and kind of ease into it because I don't know this planner very well and I want to do a nice job with it but also I'm just giving myself some grace knowing that it's just going to take a little while to really get comfortable with it. So I think I'm going to put my dinners in here and then my routine things I do at work every day in here. Um, obviously not over here. I don't know what I'll put on the weekend. I'll have to think about that. Um, I also don't have my workouts in yet. I don't know where the workouts are going to go. Uh, maybe I should put that at the bottom. I don't know. Let me know if you have suggestions because like, uh, hashtag, I don't know what I'm doing. We're back there again. So, okay, I'm going to start with dinner and th ponder this while I'm doing that. All right, got some more stuff filled in. It's it's okay. I'm liking, I'm loving the functionality. I am hating the decorative piece of this particular spread. I'm just not liking it. Right now I'm trying to find the box that I can put that's like big enough to really facilitate um, like a, my podcast. I usually put like a little box and I make it cute and I'm trying to find something that will kind of do that and not really finding anything I like. Ugh. Right, let's stick this today sticker here. I don't think it'll take until noon, but I want to reserve it anyway. So we'll go today. Find a podcast record sticker. All right, so in addition to podcasts, other stuff going on this week is I'm going to put laundry on Sunday and then Thursday because I always like to do that laundry twice a week. So I'll put this probably like a, I don't know, mid-morning deal here. And probably in the evening on Thursday. There we go. What else is going on next week? Lou and I usually try to do a date night at some point, so I think we're thinking maybe Saturday next week. Be good for that. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just really not feeling super excited about this. I'm loving how the functions go. I mean, this like loan sticker just hanging out there looks strange to me, so I don't know. It's okay. It's just, it's, I'm really not loving it. I kind of, I might wind up doing my 7x9 planner again next week just because I, I like decorating that one. <laughs> so 
<laughs> I don't know. This is, I, yeah, I don't know. The function is good. I just, I think I would really, I think I would love it if I had a kit for it. I think if I had a kit, um, or maybe a little bit of direction or knew what I was doing, I think I'd be a lot happier. So I am, I've got all the necessity stuff in at this point. Let me just check my notes and see if I had anything else to add in. Oh, trash. Let's put in a, like a little, one of those little cute trash cans. Where'd I put those? Cute trash cans. Where'd you go? And that's going to go Monday evening. I'm just going to write it. See, I also usually like to meal plan on Wednesdays, but at this point, I'm just trying to get this done so I can move on because I'm just not feeling it. If you couldn't tell, I'm trying not to be bitter about it because I think it's it's never fun to like um, be negative, but I'm just, I need to figure this out. I need to figure it out. Um, it's not going to be a instant working situation and that's okay. Just gonna take some practice. Like I said, I love how the how it's functioning. The functioning's great. It's just I don't like how it looks. It's the look, and I can fix the look. I can find stickers. I can print stickers. I can figure that piece out pretty easily. So the fact that I like the functionality is making me happy. Um, there's lots of space to write. I think that part's gonna be really cool. Um, as long as it fits on my desk, which I think it will. Uh, this will be. I think it's going to be great. So I'm just looking at the positives. The positives are that the function is good. The function is there. Um, I just need to address the aesthetics. It's okay. It's not horrible. It's not ugly, but I just, I just don't like it as much as the weeks where I use a kit. So I need to find a kit for this giant, huge monster planner that I've got myself into. I think that's it today, guys. I'm going to, I stopped looking at it because it's frustrating me and I got to go do something else because it's just making me mad. So I hope you're having a great day. I hope your, your planning is going better than my planning is today. And um, yeah, we will chat soon. Bye guys.